you got to trust me here. We are going to leave my place Friday night. We're going up the Lake Bemidji. We're going with fish and loose. We're going to catch some beautiful pike. It is gorgeous up there. Now, come on. What do you say? Doesn't that sound good? Yeah, it sounds great. I just hate to get my hopes all built up. I know we're not going. <laughs> Pringle's here to see you. Riley Pringle, I don't want to see the weenie band director. Well, it's too late. I'm already here. How do you hear that? I'll be right in, Riley. There's no need to shop. Look, look, look. Just pack all your stuff up. Get everything ready, okay? I swear to you. May lightning strike me dead. We're going fishing Friday night. Well, if you put it that way, I guess we'll see. <laughs> Smiley Riley. Just reading some of your propaganda here. Nice shot of me, isn't it? Well, anyway, football season's over, so the band is out of work, so to speak. Shouldn't you be out there boiling mouthpieces or something? It might interest you to know that just because your season is over, it doesn't mean that ours is. The band goes on tour next week. Oh, really? Where are you going? Well, uh, we start off with Potato Days in Pocatello, Idaho, and uh, then it's the Sweet Roll Festival in Bismarck, North Dakota. Um, right. Then I was kidding. I don't care where you're going. <laughs> Very well. Uh, could I have a word with you in private for a minute? I'm out of here, Coach. Oh, listen, I ordered some guacamole tip for my party. If they call, tell them my bathtub holds 30 gallons. You got it. <laughs> that party is the very reason I am here. As you undoubtedly know, I am chairman of the conduct committee. What the hell is a conduct committee? It is a committee of faculty members concerned with ensuring that the student body maintain proper conduct on and off campus. Sounds like a geek club to me. <laughs> it has real authority, Aiden. Riley, why do I have to listen to all this? Because this party is for your team, it's hosted by your assistant coach, and that makes it your responsibility. <laughs> Don't make light of this. Every year, it's gotten bigger and more out of control. Last year, things got so out of hand that several young women were apparently cajoled into removing their tops and skateboarding through fellowship halls singing, We Are the World. <laughs> Now, that's something that the conduct committee cannot close their eyes to. Well, I can see why. <laughs> that is just the kind of cavalier attitude that forces me to step in and take responsibility when you won't. There'll be no party this year. Riley, what are you talking about? You have no right to stop the party. Well, just watch us. Oh, come on, Riley, wait a minute. The kids weren't committing any crime. They'd say they're just trying to have some fun. Well, that's not my idea of fun. Well, who says it has to be your idea of fun anyway? I mean, my gosh, those kids worked so hard all year, they're just trying to blow off steam. I don't see why they can't blow off steam in a quiet and orderly fashion. Jeez, Riley, I mean, come on. Don't you ever get tired of being such a prune? I'm not going to let you stop this party. It's become a campus tradition. Now everyone goes. Not everyone. Well, everyone's invited. Not everyone. Everyone but the band. <laughs> you want the band invited this year? Certainly not. Uh, gee, Riley, the band. The band, the band, come on. The band could be that wholesome ingredient that we've been missing all these years. But no, I, I, I hadn't thought of that. I mean, I think the band being invited could be the key to this whole problem. But I won't deny that there have been hard feelings in the past. Well, I think uh, you're kind of an icebreaker here between the band and all the normal kids. <laughs> well, it would mean a lot to them. Many of the kids have never been to a party. <laughs> right, so there you go, babe. But let me just check with Garner, make sure it's okay, all right? I'm sure that anything you say will be all right with him. He's practically your dog. He is not. I brought you a paper coach. Thank you. <laughs> now, what do you think? Can the band come to your party this year? Band? Well, sure, coach. Uh, anything you say. We got a deal? On one condition, that you take full responsibility. Fine. And that means I want you on the premises for the time that decorations go up until the cleanup committee is through. <laughs> right. I want your word. May lightning strike me dead if I'm not at that party Friday night. <laughs> You're coming to the party, huh, Coach? Heck no, I'm going fishing with Luther. Don't <laughs> you promise Riley Pringle you'll be there? Yeah, I know, Doug. we got to keep a promise because those things are sacred. Tell you what, just tap me up in the wall somewhere where I can see everything. 